Many customers are looking to harden their VMware environments from a security standpoint, ranging from things like increasing the uh, security authentication against vCenter and VMware View by adding two-factor authentication, being able to see security events, including uh, all sorts of logs and changes across their entire virtualized environment, which can consist of many uh, vCenter instances. And many of them are also trying to figure out how they can leverage virtualization to make security policy and compliance fundamentally easier. This is a quick demonstration of work that's been going on between RSA, the security division of EMC, and VMware. Logging into VMware View Manager, you can see that RSA has integrated their Secure ID two-factor authentication as an option into VMware View Manager. This makes uh, uh, logging in and authenticating much more secure. Uh, as well, the backend systems that this can authenticate against, including Authentication Manager from RSA, are now available to run as a virtual appliance. This two-factor login is also available and integrated into vCenter login and management itself. RSA Envision, which is a security events information management tool, will also show and aggregate across your entire virtualized data center things like these logins, whether it's in the VMware View Manager or into vCenter itself as well as any changes that imply a security change. Now, if we log into this virtualized client, we'll be able to see how data loss prevention can also be integrated. As the VMware View user opens this PowerPoint, we'll quickly see one of the major challenges in the IT industry today, which is sensitive data leakage, uh, meaning sensitive data like credit cards or social security numbers being printed or copied to USB sticks or being emailed around. For example, this PowerPoint contains sensitive credit card information. What's stopping the user from printing this sensitive data? Well, normally nothing, but in this case, we're using RSA's data loss prevention, and it can stop it. Here, what the user will see is they'll see a warning. You can either hard enforce the rule, or you can leave it up to the end user once informed of the corporate policy around what they want to do. If you take a look at the RSA DLP dashboard, you'll see how this works in a little more detail. Specifically, there's a whole set of policies including out-of-the-box policies around things like compliance with the PCI standards. You can see that what this does is it looks at, at the actual content being emailed or printed or being used on the systems against a content blade, and specifically here a credit card number. When the policy is triggered, the action can vary from warning the user, leaving the choice up to them, to actually stopping them from being able to copy or move the sensitive data. Virtualizing your environment with VMware gives you a new opportunity to make the environment more secure than it's ever been. RSA can harden the environment by providing two-factor authentication into View Manager and vCenter. RSA and Vision can integrate security events management across the entire virtualized data center. And the RSA Data Loss Prevention Suite can actually inspect against content within either virtualized clients or virtualized server environments to make sure that you're not leaking sensitive information. Lastly, RSA is trying to make these capabilities available as virtual machines themselves. The first step is supporting all of these capabilities running on VMs, which is available now. And the next step is making them available as virtual appliances. Thanks very much. This has been a quick discussion about hardening VMware environments using RSA, the security division of EMC's tools and capabilities.